Okay, so we've rinsed it for 30 minutes, and then uh, what you do is you just take the bag, just kind of let it drain, and then you just give it a nice gentle squeeze. You can see how dirty that water is, and just set it in the other side of the sink, or if you have a pail or a bucket, you can just set it in there. Oh, there's the big one. Nice gentle squeeze. And you don't have to get all the water out, you know, because we're going to rinse this like two more times. Okay, then I'm going to drain the sink. Now you want to rinse it so your drain water is almost clear. And it really doesn't take that long. I mean, it takes me like, what, five minutes to put it in the water. I sit down for 30 minutes and kind of get a cup of coffee or watch a TV show or something. I come back, it takes me just a few more minutes to do this. So really, all in all, it really only takes maybe 10 or 15 minutes, but I guess the waiting process is like making a loaf of bread, you know, where it takes like three hours to make the loaf of bread because you have to, to, have to wait for it to rise. But, um, you know, if you want to clean your own fleece and make sure you get your own fleece back, because a lot of people do send it to mills, which is fine. You know, it saves you a lot of time, but it does cost money, and a lot of times you won't get your own fleece back. So if you have a special animal or a prize animal that you want to make sure that you get your own fleece back, this is really the way to go. So um, I'm going to fill this back up and let it sit another 30 minutes and then we'll come back and I'll show you the rest of it.